Shown here, the man on the right, George R. Perrix, is inspecting his troops at a Canadian Officers' Training Corps parade in Victoria, B.C. Born in England in 1888, he was to become a decorated and celebrated member of the Canadian military. At 18, he moved to Canada and joined the Royal Canadian Northwest Mounted Police before enlisting in the Army and serving in Europe during World War I. He was awarded the Military and Victoria Cross during the Battle of Passchendaele serving again in World War II despite serious illness in 1940. He was put in charge of the 2nd Canadian Infantry, pictured here, dating this photo between November and December of 1941. After the war, Pex returned to the west coast of Terrace, BC, preventing one of the largest mutinies in Canadian history. Pex eventually retired from the army and enjoyed a lengthy political career. He was appointed Lieutenant Governor of BC in 1950. The photograph fails to mask the exhausting demand for young, able-bodied men. A line to the left are the Canadian Officers Training Corps, established in 1912, a unit in the active militia of Canada. Interest in the corps declined in the 1950s and came to an end in 1964.